Now that's something fit for a superstar. The ultimate Barbie the movie car. Hello fellow doll lovers, Barbie Nation here. Welcome, welcome back to my channel. Hello everyone, thank you so much for tuning into another video with me today. My name is Aryan, aka Barbie Nation, and what I do is I collect dolls. I play with dolls, I talk about dolls, and every now and then I give them a super cute makeover. So if you're into anything cute, sweet, and petite, definitely subscribe to my channel to get some lovely pastel glitters on your feed. Now let's get into this Barbie car today. Here we go. So it is Barbie movie release week and I hope you all get a chance to see the movie. And so I have again a Barbie movie item for you guys to share today, which is the car. When, okay, so back when I first saw this picture released of the car that they were going to make, I was so ecstatic because um, I think I told you guys about that Barbie Chevrolet from the 90s that, or late 80s, early 90s. That was such an iconic and one of the best Barbie cars ever made. Barbie's got a car that's hot. A 57 Chevy is what she's got. She looks so cool as she goes. The trunk can close. The Barbie 57 Chevy. We are to Barbie. Each sold separately, you put car together. Until this one came around the corner. Yeah, from the whole Barbie movie doll franchise line, the car is absolutely number one on, you know, the list for me. I mean, I love the dolls, don't get me wrong, but this car is just so freaking epic. There are two cars and the remote control car is actually a lot smaller. It only has two seats. This one has four seats. We're gonna test that out if it actually can hold four dolls, but um, yeah, four seats, and it's a lot bigger actually than the remote control car. Yeah, so this box, I mean, it is super giant pink. I mean, I really, I cannot wait to get this car out, but I just love this box so freaking much. I mean, look at all the details on this box. It has the pastel Barbie actually driving it. And I really want to recreate that movie poster picture where, you know, uh, she's sitting in a car with a blue outfit on. So I really want to recreate that picture. And of course, what do we need? Well, first, that car. <laughs> but on the box, it has the pastel girl on it. And I actually did a video on her and the outfits uh, a week ago, so you can check that if you'd like. So I already have that blue outfit. So blue outfit, check. The car now, check. And the last thing I wanna get is the cowgirl, and I actually wanna give her the blue outfit. And I do like the cowgirl very much, but I just wanna keep her in the box and don't really unbox her. So I thought, you know, she has, I think the longest length of hair so that's why i want to have a second one of her to unbox and also because that outfit is just so freaking iconic and i really want to use it on other dolls and other looks in the future 
Okay, let's see. Now, this is what I call a Barbie car. So the first thing I actually noticed was that it doesn't have any mirrors on the side. But looking back on the picture, yeah, it didn't. <laughs> so that's normal. So the door opens on the front. And like I said earlier, it can hold four dolls. And yeah, it actually has some leg room here in the back. So four dolls can make it into the car. The other door also opens and also the trunk. Look at that Barbie sign here on the back. I love it. A voila. So she can put her things in the trunk. Just look at the inside. Oh. It is so pretty. Okay, I'm just gonna take some pretty shots of this car and let you enjoy that because um, I can hardly fit it into this frame. It's that big. <laughs> So what I really love that it's actually like an homage to the actual T-Bird that the Beach Boys are singing about in their song. And um, yeah, because it is inspired on the 1955 Thunderbird, I guess, from the... Was it Ford? Well, anyway, it totally gives us, you know, 50s, early 60s vibes. And that is just... Yeah, that is a great... Those hold some of the greatest convertible cars, especially in pink. <gasps> so it's only fitting for Barbie to have a car like that, right? And that's pretty much all there is to it about this car. It also came with this uh, certificate of authenticity. Um, and here it's actually just called Barbie the Movie Vehicle. Yeah. So I just can't wait to get my hands now on the cowgirl. So. Be on the lookout for that because I'm going to get the cowgirl, unbox her and redress her, give her a whole cute new look and then we're gonna put her in the car and then we're gonna have some fun recreating that shoot. So it was a quick one today and I just really really wanted to show you this car and let me know down in the comments below are you gonna get this car? Do you have the remote control one? Are you gonna get both of them maybe or either which one um did you also have plans of recreating that movie poster shoot you know all the tea let's share the excitement for this epic barbie car down in the comments below <laughs>
Okay, so that's it for today, guys. Thank you all so much for watching. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And of course, click the bell icon next to the subscribe button to get notified about any new videos that I upload. You can also follow me on Instagram at Barbie Nation. That's usually where I post all of my videos. And until the next video, mwah, big kisses from me and I love you all.